Good morning, DD fam. Look at this absolutely perfect day we have in front of us. We have a five hour road trip. We have a million dollar 4GT. That's right, the 4GT has eluded me. I've applied for it twice. I've been denied twice. I've had the opportunity to drive a couple of 4GTs, one of them being Schmi 150's 4GT at the Hoonigan Burnyard. Absolute tire slayer. It's a car that I've wanted on the channel for a long, long time. So we need to hit the road. We need to pick a car. The Murcielago isn't probably the most reliable car right now. Neither is the Huracan. So I think we're just gonna have to go with this. So today's key belongs to none other than Dave DD's black on black Lamborghini Huracan. I'm taking this because I do not want to destroy all that gorgeous new carbon fiber we just put on the 720. We want to make sure we protect all that carbon. We have a brand new wrap that has been ordered. Next week, we're going to start the brand new edition one first livery on the 720. And we will be fixing my Huracan so that I can get back into it and slay some more tires. Let's do a cold start, shall we? Guys, a black car can be one of the best looking cars when it's clean. When it's dirty, it looks absolutely disgusting. When you're in a Huracan, there's only one way to drive it. You wanna hold this button down right here to the left of the steering wheel, and you wanna get it in the full tack position. That is the best way to drive this car. And then, well, right here, you're gonna to wanna to take this from Strada, and you're gonna to wanna to take it all the way down to Corsa. There's really only one way to air dry a Lamborghini. My exhaust is mean. It means business. Never resist a good pedal blast. Just saying, Dave's car is crazy. <laughs> Everybody, welcome Dave to the channel. Hey guys. I picked up a straggler on the side of the road hitchhiking. The only reason why I'm still driving is because he brought all his luggage and I am not sitting with that stuff on my lap. We got a Ford GT coming our way. All right, you guys, we've finally arrived here at SR Auto Group, Vancouver's premier hypercar destination. This front end is absolutely covered in bugs. Dave, welcome back to the What's channel. What's up, you guys? How's it going? Miss How me? How you doing? I'm good. Are Sunny we, out here. Oh, Mercedes today or what? Well, isn't that I a composer's am, hat? It actually is composer's, you stole hat. composer's I, I, hat. I did steal. I do apologize, composer. I stole your hat. I owe you one. <laughs> Come collect. All right, you guys, as much as I'd love to have a P1, a 918, and an F40, we're going to trade all these cars in for this one right here. Oh. So let's Let's go and reveal. Hold on, hold on, come back. Put this down. What? This video is sponsored by Manski. That car is brand new. It's perfect. Are you brand new and perfect? I don't think so. Looking a little hairy, a little itchy. Let's do some manscaping. That's right, you guys. Manscaped. The men's grooming product that has been proven to save over 1 million men's marriages simply by shaving your balls. Today, we are going to demonstrate on Dave after two divorces how he can save his third marriage when he gets married the third time. Now, the Lawnmower 3.0 made by Manscaped is the perfect device to get close to your balls and remove all hair. Unwanted hair is the number one reason why most people get divorced. It's true. Don't you wish Manscaped came along a little sooner in your first or second marriage? I honestly always thought it was the adultery. It turns out it was hairy balls that caused both my marriages to end. So Damon, you're telling me that all I need is this little guy right here and there's no need for a prenup in my next marriage? Oh man, I'm in. This is so very private. Now you're good. Don't look at me! Don't look at me! Uh, the carpet's dirty now. Okay, that's all done. Oh, you son of a Now, the next thing you're gonna want is some ball reviver. That smells good. 
Last but not least, a little bit of ball deodorant. Sweet, I'm in. How much do I need? Oh! Guys, go to the link in the description and pick up your Manscaped Perfect Package 3.0. You're gonna get the Lawnmower 3.0, the only trimmer on the market made with advanced skin safe trademark technology, the ball toner and the ball deodorant. It's gonna come with two free gifts, the shed travel bag and a pair of amazing boxer briefs. Oh, those are amazing. Which have contour flex material, breathability, and also repels moisture. You're gonna get 20% off plus free shipping. DD fam, when you purchase these limited edition boxer briefs, as part of the new Perfect Packers 3.0 kit online. You can opt in the peak hygiene plan and get a new boxer brief for replenishment in every cycle delivered straight to your door, hassle free. Go now, get 20% off, free shipping, and two free gifts. Manscaped.com forward slash DD. Hey, put your balls away. We got a car to go and drive. I don't want to tease you anymore, but here we are. This is the key that has evaded me for over two years. I've applied twice for the Ford GT and have been denied twice. Now, for whatever reason, Ford has not wanted me to have this key and up until now, no one has been able to buy a Ford GT without Ford's permission. That is until today. Hey guys, without any further ado, boom, the brand new Ford GT, triple black, carbon wheels, dry carbon everywhere, dry carbon mirrors. We have a full dry carbon interior. This thing is absolutely mad. Check out the carbon fiber engine bay, you guys. Oh, an absolute dream. This example here is all delivery miles, brand spanking new. Check this out, you guys, doors go up. We have everything still in place. Raymond has kept this car for two years, unable to sell it. You were not able to buy a Ford GT without Ford's permission. The two year two resale years. ban was lifted. That's and, amazing. And guess when it was lifted, you guys? This two car is literally days ago. All carbon. As you look in the vents and everywhere, everywhere, is that raw, like race car carbon? Yeah. How pumped are you right now? I'm super pumped. Look at this. It's complete delivery spec. All right, you guys, this GT is fully spec'd out. It has a $50,000 leather interior package. This is the EcoBoost Le Mans winning V6 twin turbo. And down here, you were able to get an upgraded Akrapovich titanium exhaust system, which is what we have on this spec. So I'm going to go inside right now i'm gonna give you guys the cold start remember this is lamal winning technology right here in our fingertips with this key take off the steering wheel condom as I would like to call it. Look at this absolute amazing piece of machinery. I love how they actually went ahead and actually like cut holes in the paddles. I think they did everything possible to make this car as light as they could. This has a black leather package that was a $50,000 option. So the seats are all this really lush, beautiful black leather and everything else is basically carbon fiber. We have an Alcantara headliner, and it's just, like I said, triple black. Black exterior, black wheels, all dry carbon, black interior. As mean as it gets when it comes to a brand new Ford GT. Believe it or not, this car only has 10 miles on it. Proof, 10 miles. It's also got no gas. <laughs> so let's take this bad boy for a rip. We're gonna put a few more miles on that 10 mile odometer. Down here on the dial, on the GT, you go past reverse, neutral, and into drive. And then you can go into manual mode. So in the center here, that M is for manual. And now you can pull the paddle and you'll go into first gear. What's crazy is it shares some parts from traditional Fords. Like, you look at the door lock on that door there and the window switch, that's yeah. like from an F-150. Lift system right in here, right in between. And the lift system is what we're gonna wanna use. To go the lift up. is shockingly fast. It literally jumps like a 64 Impala. It jumps really it's quick. Like a 64 scary. Impala. It actually scared me. I was like, what the hell? The first time I did it. You hear a turbo spool even at low RPM. Yeah. Oh yeah. There's that Le Mans winning technology. The Eco Boost. <laughs> that sounds really good. That exhaust. That's really good. It's a V6. It's how 
sounds like a floaty V8. Unique. I'll put it in race mode, goes right to the ground, the wing shoots up. It's the best thing since sliced bread, you guys. You know how much I love sliced bread. You guys ready for this? This is the new Ford GT going into race mode. Oh. Wing up. And the doors go up. Does it get any better than this? Ford, you've definitely outdone yourself with this one. But is this, with a V6 and a couple of twin turbos, is it considered a hypercar? Eh, I don't know. What is hypercar these days? That's pretty debatable. But I'll tell you this, it is one sexy machine. It is one I would love to have in my stable. Am I gonna spend a million dollars on a Ford GT? They're still having people apply for them. Even though you can go now and buy a 2018 model, now that it's been two years, and no longer get Ford's permission. So I think I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna stay out of the Ford GT market myself, personally, at the moment. If you want, this is a great buy still right now. I've never seen a triple black Ford GT with the $50,000 leather package, all the dry carbon. This car is for sale for $1 million US dollars from SR Auto Group. Give Raymond a call. anything else I've ever been in. Nothing. It's super unique. It sounds really good. I love this car more after this drive. You definitely feel the torque and the power coming from yeah. those turbos. Oh, yeah. It's impressive what they've built. Because you think V6, you don't think, you know, you don't think this. No, you driven like, <laughs> like a Raptor V6 and all those cars. It's just not like this at all. It's amazing. Amazing view. the Damon face too. Oh, of course you are. Can't help it in this car. This car is the Damon face. Woo! I like it. I want one. I want one. But I think we got something else. What do you think? I'm getting the audience a little wink right now. A little wink? Give him a wink. You had a wink? Yeah, kind of. That's how I picked up my wife. A wink down. It was like this. Hey! Guys, Mini Fam, I absolutely love this car. I don't want to have to give it back. I think for our first million dollar car or over a million dollar car, I think I have something else in mind. Oh, the doors. At least I have the doors for the meantime on my 720. I love the headlights, you guys. Look at the headlights. The headlights are stunning. They killed it with the headlight design on this car. Well, what do you think, Dave? I think let's go sign some paperwork. Signing paperwork. G T D D E. Oh, Ray. Why do you do this to me? Just buy it. Hey guys, if you guys need a hyper car, this is where you need to call SR Auto Group. Call Raymond, harass him. We sell Hondas. Look what's back. That's right, the DDE ITR, the Canadian spec one and only red interior Integra Type R is back in the channel. I don't even know if you guys are excited to even see this. I'm excited to see it back. This was Dave's and my teenage fantasy to own. I never had one of these. You had one for six months. When I was 20 when I bought it. My payment was like $800 a month. I made $8 an hour Pizza Hut. And six months later, I was like, I just couldn't afford it. So I had to get rid of it. And then we bought one and we left it in LA and forgot about it. At a hotel parking lot though. <laughs> Thank you, Avenue of the Arts. Avenue of the Arts, you're amazing. Thanks for putting up with our Integra for the last year. It's been sitting down there, but she's back on Canadian soil. We got an interesting story. We have a fun little trade-in that we might do. We might trade this in against something for a slight upgrade. All right, guys, well, that's it for today's episode. I know I love this car as much as you guys do, but 
This man holds the keys to everything. Give me my car back, take this piece of home. He's finally yours. Get out of here. We can't tell him until the next video. Smash the subscribe button. You guys are gonna wanna see what's up in the next video. We bought something a little ridiculous. A little ridiculous. Craziest. Can we afford this? Nope. We're doing it anyhow. Yep. Peace. Right? Sticky tires, pick up all the road grit. Lots of road grit. It feels grit. like being in a race car. Number one, we're very close right now. Like I can literally feel his precipitation. You can feel my breath. I can feel his breath, I can feel the sweat of his glands.